everybody and welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel so first things first let's get the elephant in the room out of the way I've got my Invisalign I have started an Invisalign journey I'm getting used to it I've got my lisp wearing it well um, but yeah it's it's getting it's getting it's taking me some time to get used to it so my speech is a little bit affected so here I am but I'm actually here to follow up on a video that I have done recently about my rosacea and I thought that I will do another little video but this time I'm going to show you my full routine and how do I still massage my face even though I have sensitivity in my skin and I have rosacea and I'm going to show you how I've been treating my rosacea and it's been doing really well really really well considering it's summer considering all the sun all of that um, there's a lot of like aggravating aspects that my skin tends to, re to react to but I've been keeping it in check and super super content with it hence I thought I will do another video so let's jump in I'll be doing my evening routine with you and I'm going to show you exactly how I massage when I'm doing my routine Last time I showed you and mentioned that the main thing that has been really helping my rosacea is prescription based skincare and that definitely hasn't changed. This has arrived through the post again and it arrives every month um, which is makes it super easy to keep on top of and this is my personal prescription based um, cream serum that is designed for my rosacea for my sensitivity Dermatica is a, a brand that is amazing if you have any kind of concerns when it comes to your skin it can be sensitivities it can be anti-aging it can be acne so if you are looking to introduce one product to your routine I would definitely look at Dermatica because it has transformed my skin it has made my skin journey so much easier because my skin tends to be it's like a roller coaster using dermatica has been really nice because it keeps it balanced and even and i think that's what all of us want so the prescriptions are designed by dermatologists so what you do you go online you fill a questionnaire you upload your pictures you talk about your concerns you talk about what you actually want from this prescription what you want from this um, product and then they design it for you and you subscribe and you get it every single month through the post and it is right there on your doorstep and if you're not sure about it you can try your first month for £2.90 with my discount code so I'm going to leave it on the screen and I'm going to also leave it in the description box so just to kind of give you that testing period that won't cost you a lot of money and then you can cancel the subscription at any point anyways let's jump into my routine we will come to the dermatica in a little bit but i'm going to start with the cleanser so i don't have any makeup on i only have a little bit of spf on um so i'm going to be using the votary super sensitive cleansing cream this is a really nice gentle cleanser it is nice and thick to remove any uh, debris any makeup any product that you might have had before so I apply it all over my face and then I wet my hands this is where the first part of the massage starts because when you have sensitive skin massaging with oils cannot always be very easy so I will lather it up and then I start massaging my skin I will massage my neck in circular motions you can follow along if you're doing your routine and then the other side as well, just to get that lymph nodes going. And then a little bit of sculpting of the jawline using my knuckles. And then we will continue with the knuckles, circling into the cheeks. So massaging with your cleanser is a perfect, perfect way to introduce massage into your routine. Not everybody has the time to sit down for 10, 20 minutes and massage their skin. So you can do this in the morning, you can do this in the evening uh, when you are doing your routine. And that's how easy it becomes to actually massage your face. Don't forget to massage your chin. Relaxing this area, we carry a lot of tension in the jaw and the chin area. And then you can also massage each nose and elbow folds. And then using your fingers, lifting those lines, 
I add in the mold. And you can always reapply more water if you need to lather a little bit more. Massaging the nose and around the sinuses. But this always feels like a really nice release because there's a large circular muscle around our eyes. And the connections are right here, so massaging this area can release a lot of tension and really brighten up the eye area as well as really open up your breathing. Using the knuckles, we're going to slide under the cheekbones, really getting those knuckles under the cheekbone. Scooping, lifting, but more than that, releasing the tension in the jaw and the chewing muscle. If you tend to clench or grind your teeth, there's pretty much nobody that I know who doesn't have tension in the jaw. Circles around the eyes. So this is also great if you tend to have reactive skin that reacts to oils or products that you massage with. Because then you just simply wash it off and you continue with your normal routine. Massaging between the brows. Just creating a little pinch between the brows and then you can work your way out as well. And it doesn't take long, like if I was doing it on my own, it would just take me maybe two minutes maximum. So there are no excuses <laughs> then to not massage your face. And we're gonna stop at the temples, this little figure right here. Nice little friction movement around the forehead. If you've been doing a lot of thinking, frowning. So from the center outwards, using your knuckles up and down. And exactly the same on the other side. And then you can massage the middle of the forehead with your fingertips. Nice big slides from the center out to the temples. And then you can massage above the lip. Ironing out the smoker's lines again, softening the circular motion, the circular muscle. And a couple of sweeps down. And now we can wash it off. Oof. So I wipe my face with the toilet paper because I prefer toilet paper to towels because they don't breed bacteria. And I genuinely think that little changes like that can make a big difference to your skin because if you are using a cloth, um, it's not a problem, but you do have to use a clean one every single time. Continue with the routine. I'm going to go with a little toner and we're going to be using the Mystique, which is a hydrating treatment from Cosmetics. And I like that it comes in a spray, nice and refreshing. It's kind of like perfect for dry, sensitive or breakout prone skin. So I've um, been using it for a while and I really, really like it. So now it's time for my treatment. So I'm going to be using again my little Dermatica and I take a couple of pumps and that goes all over my face. Doing a routine like that, I still feel like I get my massage fix. So if I massage um, before the application of the product, if I massage with my cleanser, but then I don't have to aggravate the skin and almost any product that I put after helps it calm down, soothe it, hydrate it, moisturize it. So this is my treatment on. And while that is doing its thing, I'm going to use my eye cream. This is the Iraya Deep Tox eye cream. It's a really nice light texture. So we'll do a little bit of eye massage while 
the dramatic treatment is sinking in. So I'm going to use my ring finger to go for circular motions around. Nice and gentle. Stop at the bridge of the nose for some circles. And then you can go with your thumbs. Bit more pressure under the brow. And you can also go the peace signs. Lining out the crow's feet, draining the lymph and the toxins out. Little sweep down. Little pat, pat, pat. And by now my treatment would have absorbed so we can go with a moisturizer. So the moisturizer of the moment is a bit of a niche one because it is not like super known brand. It is not necessarily available everywhere. But I um, have purchased three jars so far. And it's kind of one of those creams that I kind of feel now I can never be without. Um, it is the Even Swiss Rich Regenerating Cream. If anybody's familiar with the brand, let me know. Um, because I have been really loving it. It is very good for supporting the barrier of your skin. It almost makes it a little bit firmer, uh, which I really like. And also it is just so hydrating and so soothing. I love it. Like I've been pretty obsessed with it. So don't forget your neck. And obviously because this is my evening routine, I'm not going to be going with any SPFs or anything like that. Um, but that is it, my friends. This is how I would massage routine with sensitive skin, with rosacea prone skin. Um, it can also apply to uh, acne prone skin. So if you're using a treatment that is acne prone, is targeting your breakouts, um, the same if you're using a dermatica treatment, you can do this as well with a cleanser. Um, massaging with your cleanser is so much easier. You can literally do it in a shower. Just don't do it under hot water. Um, but if you have any questions, let me know. Like I said, I will leave the details for Dermatica below. All the lists with the products that I have used today will be below as well. Um, any questions, let me know. I hope you're all doing well, of course. And thank you so much for hanging out with me. And I hope to see you very soon. Bye.